Hey guys, welcome to my playthrough of Forza Motorsport 7. I'm pretty excited about playing this game. Um, this morning I started, I bought this game and I was really excited and I tried it a little bit. But I'm gonna start for you again. I think the intro is pretty cool. I really liked it and I cannot overstate how great this game looks. Uh, so for the record, we are playing on PC on ultra settings at 2K resolution. Let's go ahead. Every driver has a story to tell of their first race, their first race car. Drivers will talk about their victories, their losses, and their journey. Here is the starting point for racing dreams, where aspiring drivers begin forging their own legacy. For a select devoted few, awaits not just the finish line, but the chance to become a racing legend. Welcome to Forza Motorsport. I'm here to help you achieve racing glory. Now this is where your journey starts. And trust me when I say it's gonna be a hard fought, hard driving road to win the cup. It'll be a road full of choices you'll have to make. And here's the first one. Who are you? Chico or Chica? What? Why is my mouse not working? That sucks. Okay. Time to pick out your first driver gear. You'll come across more as you race. This is weird. I guess a glitch within the game. I cannot select anything with my mouse. Well, get, let's get that out of the way. I'm kind of torn between both of these. I think, I mean, this is really cool, it's simple, but there's just too much branding on it. Let's go with this one for now. From here, you have a choice between starting your campaign for the Forza Drivers' Cup jumping into multiplayer to race against drivers from all over the world, or exploring at your own pace. Uh, yeah, we are gonna go with Forza Drivers' Cup. The Forza Drivers' Cup. The world's Very excited. Largest, most diverse, sanctioned motorsport series. For decades, it's drawn the racing world's best. To win, it will take speed, versatility and adaptability spanning five continents and the world's most legendary circuits only a few will climb to the top where racing immortality awaits the winner but first step into the shoes of past winners and learn what it takes to win driving's top prize the guy on the like, extreme left in such a cool suit. The defining element of racing. Speed is more than the miracles of engineering and design. It is drivers who embrace the pursuit of going ever faster. Last season's cup winner, Michael Mueller, is one of those drivers. Known for bringing record-breaking cars to the track, he turned heads at the Dubai Invitational, 
when he drove a car no one knew existed. And we are gonna drive it. This looks so cool. Michael Miller. Uh, I have to change the controls because they normally give you WASD and I want to do it with the arrow keys instead. Right. Yeah, this works for me. Uh, I don't know why it's saying 3840 by 2160 because that is not even the max resolution for my monitor, but like I said, 2K. Let's go. I think that's a BMW i8 on my left. It looks really nice. That is a Corvette. I'm really happy with my car. Just in case. Breaking a bit early because it's really easy to mess with these fast cars. I'm playing a racing game after a very long time. The last I played was Forza Horizon 3 a year ago. I generally don't play many racing games. I used to growing up, I was a big Need for Speed fan, but as I grew up I realized how much that sucks. The confetti reminds me of Horizon 3 in fact. The Horizon Festival. Looks really cool. I'm finding it hard to overtake these two, they are really fast. If I get a little bit of a straight, maybe I can just overtake them with speed, but right now, wondering they are better than me. Maybe I can overcome it a bit on the corner and see where it goes. That seems to be my only option right now. Maybe take one of them out, get a second place. It's a really good shot. Come on, come on, come on. Oh yeah. Just one more, one more. Come on. You can do it. Oh yeah. Bad. Versatility means becoming a master of any vehicle.
To win the cup, drivers must be versatile because they will not win with just one car, no matter how much speed they apply. Yeah, we are dropping some frame rates because of the simultaneous Rossi video recording, the screen recording. Lead, and eventually the Forza Drivers' Cup itself by having the skill to drive something as unconventional as a racing truck to victory. We're gonna drive a racing truck now. Excited. Maria Rossi. I am trying to stay somewhere in the middle because most of the accidents or like body checks happen near the road. So a good start is very important. Although this race seems a lot slower, of course, if we can manage it. This is much easier. I have to admit, I imagine that racing with a truck around the track was going to be much more stiff. This handles very, very you know, like easy compared to what I thought. Maybe it's because of the speed. I mean, it's really slow, so it's not that hard to turn. So it seems I'm not doing a very good job at it. They are nowhere behind us. This was really one side. I hope the next one is a lot better. Adaptability. Only the prepared will be able to cope with any change on the track. Cup legend Yukio Takagi is renowned for remaining focused, even during a downpour. To win the Forza Drivers' Cup, drivers must adapt, because speed and versatility are not... Look at how no cool that looks. The, same. the reflections. Oh my god. Suzuka. This used to be the last race of the Formula 1 season, like a decade ago, I think. That was during the time of Michael Schumacher. I stopped watching it after he retired. The first time. The second one wasn't good at all. Shouldn't have come back. Not for the team he came back in any way. I mean, but he knows more. I mean, who am I to comment?
this is definitely the biggest of the three. I cannot stop staring at the weather effects. It's gonna be no racking inside the cockpit. I'm, I'm not gonna take that view for a few places at least. So I wanna get up to speed and get used to the bounce a little bit before I fire a distance. Or maybe we can try it a little bit, like for a while, since I'm in the first place anyway. Hold on, let me get it straight. Yeah, right here is good. That is sick. But I can't see anything. This is So that's the last race of the intro. After this, they are gonna put us in the career mode and go through the toy. Now you've seen what it takes to win. Speed, versatility, and adaptability. Now, it's up to you. You're about to take part in the premier contest in all of racing. The Forza Drivers' Cup draws only the best. Yeah, it'll be a challenge, but when you lift that trophy, everyone will know you're the world's greatest driver. I wish I could talk like that. That was so cool, the way these guys speak. Anyway, I think uh, this is a good point to end the first video and we're gonna return with the second one. Let me know your thoughts in the comments, like or dislike if you didn't like it, leave a suggestion in the comment and you know like if you want me to play through any of these specific races just like take let me know what you want me to take part in. Bye!